I've been using the law of attraction and manifesting for over five years and in that time, I've seen what really works and picked up a lot of tricks. It's a journey and I'm still learning, but today I want to share 10 things that have brought me success so far. It would be rude not to, right? These tips work. They always get me the results I want, and I want the same for you. So let's jump right in with the first one. 1. Handwrite your desires. The first step I always take after deciding I want something is to write it down. Don't type out your desires on your phone or computer. Grab a pen and paper and do it the old-fashioned way. Why? You know how we always talk about the power of energy and how real it is? When you're writing out your desires by hand, the energy is flowing from you, to the pen, to the piece of paper, and creating magic. I've tried typing out desires in word processors or in my phone's notes app in the past and it's just not the same. I don't feel a strong connection like I do when I handwrite. Describe every detail of what you want. Let's say you'd like to manifest your dream job. Think not only about what you want your job title to be. Think about the salary you want, the location you want to work in. What does the building look like? How would you like to get there? Is it driving distance or will you get the train? Is it easy to park outside? If healthy eating is important to you, you want some good lunch options nearby too, right? What's the energy like in the building? Is it buzzy and fast-paced? Is it peaceful and quiet? What are your colleagues like? Do you hang out together outside of work? How do they treat you? And most importantly, how do you feel when your alarm goes off every morning and it's time for work? Are you excited, ready to go? How do you feel when you step into that building? Do you love what you do? Is it fun? Challenging? You're designing your dream life here. Be very specific, because you will get exactly what you ask for. Just in case you do forget anything, I've recently started adding the words, thank you for this or something even better to the end of my notes. One last tip for writing out your desires, use the present tense. Don't write things like I will have my dream job or I want my dream job unless you want to remain in a state of wanting or waiting. Write things like my dream job is, I have, I am, remember that your desire is yours already. Once you've decided you want it, it's ready and waiting for you in the spiritual realm. The law of attraction is what helps you to manifest it into the physical realm. When you think about it like this, it's a lot easier to believe what you're writing out in the present tense.